A LOCAL WOMAN ONCE CONVICTED OF MANSLAUGHTER APPEARED BEFORE JUDGE TODAY ON NEW CHARGES. REBECCA JOHNSON'S CHARGED WITH POSSESSION OF A HANDGUN BY A CONVICTED FELON. SOME PEOPLE AREN'T HAPPY JOHNSON'S OUT OF JAIL TODAY. OUR MARK VANDERHOFF JOINS US LIVE FROM THE NEWSROOM TO EXPLAIN. MARK? Well, Karen, Tammy Cantrell Williams is the mother of one of the two young men Rebecca Johnson killed in 2006 in a DUI crash. Cantrell Williams is furious that Johnson walked out of the court today a free woman. Rebecca Johnson waived her right to a hearing today in Jefferson District Court. Now, a grand jury will decide whether to indict her. Johnson was arrested in October on drug and gun charges and charged last week with possession of a handgun by a convicted felon. But Johnson posted a $1,500 bond Friday and is now out of jail. That's something that frustrates Tammy Cantrell Williams. Johnson was convicted of two counts of manslaughter for a 2006 crash that killed Cantrell Williams' son, Justin Cantrell, and another man, Benjamin McIntosh. Johnson was given five years probation. We cannot bring Ben and Justin back. At our Thanksgiving table on this Thursday, there will be an empty chair beside me. Now, Rebecca Johnson and her lawyer declined to speak with us after her hearing. She's due back in court next month. Live in the newsroom, Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.